One of the first things I remember being told when I believe it was my GP was telling me uh, that it seemed like a possible MS diagnosis was not to Google it. After that appointment, I think basically the first thing I did was go home and Google MS because uh, I didn't really know much about it. One of the things I came across was a, uh, uh, a chart, uh, a scale of uh, MS disability that went from 1 to 10. Uh, and I started it at, uh, at 1, and it didn't look too bad. By the time I got to 5, uh, it was a uh, wheelchair. <laughs> uh, I mean, it, very quickly on that chart of 1 to 10 of disability, with 10 being death, mobility has started to be measured in number of steps you can take which was uh, pretty discouraging. Um, yeah, and the, you know, number five, that's halfway through the chart, um, was wheelchair. You know, it's something that struck in, in my mind was uh, the, uh, you know, at the time the statistics were published, 10 years after diagnosis, 50% uh, of people were wheelchair bound, um, which was <laughs> horrifying. Luckily, these are old fashioned statistics. Um, you know, around the time I was diagnosed, within a couple of years before I was diagnosed, um, these numbers started to change because after decades of uh, research, there finally started to be drugs that actually made a statistical difference in the, the progress of um, relapsing, remitting MS. It's, uh, it's been 10 years since my MS diagnosis and I'm not wheelchair bound and uh, there are good drug therapies for MS that reduce the frequency of uh, relapses for our RMS and uh, basically slow down the progress of the disease. You know, so I'm very grateful for the research, for the funding for the research. Um, it's definitely affected my, my case and, uh, and my, my life. Um, I'm very grateful for donations that support quality of life for people uh, with MS who need support um, because it's a, it's a disease that can take away your ability to work and uh, support yourself. I play, I play soccer once a week. I'm not the worst player on my team, <laughs> definitely not the best. Um, my team, I don't think my team knows, they may know now, I don't think my team knows I have MS. I'm very grateful. I keep saying this, very grateful for, uh, for uh, the mobility that I have and the, the therapy that's available. Why do I walk? I walk because I can. Uh, thanks for listening. Please support my walk. Come and join me if you wish. And uh, hopefully I'll see you, see you on Sunday. Otherwise, very much appreciate any donations, any support you can give to uh, the fund, the cause, and uh, those suffering. Thanks. Ciao.